Hi, in this video we're going to look at the relationship between a circle and a random point. Look at the first case. We have the radius which is in red. We have a random point and we're going to call the distance from the center to the random point D. Now if the distance D, which is running from the center to a random point, is less than the distance of the radius, then we can conclude that the point is inside the circle, as you can see in the diagram. Let's look at case two. If the distance between the center of the circle and the point is equal to the distance of the radius, then our conclusion is that the point lies on the circumference of the circle. We look at case three. If the distance from the center to the random point is greater than the distance of the radius, then our conclusion is the point lies outside the circle. And we have our three diagrams showing you the three different cases. Let's look at an example. Let's look at an example. Determine whether the point minus 7, 1 lies inside, outside, or on the circumference of the circle. And the circle is given by x plus 2 all squared plus 1 minus 5 all squared is equal to 40. So what do we know? We know the radius is the square root of 49, which will be 7. So the distance of the radius is 7 units. Going into the question, we know the center of the circle is minus 2, 5. The point given is minus 7, 1. We're now going to find the distance between the center and this point. We're going to substitute that into the distance formula. Minus 2 minus minus 7 gives you a plus 7. We're squaring that. And 5 minus 1 all squared. And if we work this out using our calculators, we will get 6.4 units. Now you'll notice that the distance d is less than the radius. And our conclusion would be that the point lies inside the circle. Remember, if the distance was equal to the radius, if this was 7 and 7, then we will conclude the point lies on the circumference. And in the last case, if d was bigger than the radius, let's suppose we got 10, then 10 is greater than 7, then that point will lie outside. But in this case, we can conclude that the point lies inside the circle.